For me, the design process begins um, with an idea and with a collaborative idea, in a sense. Um, so we tend to be very driven by a concept and we tend to be driven by um, trying to break ground, trying to bring something new to, to a field that might not have this new idea. Um, so it really sort of starts more like here in the ether um, um, and then sort of goes, goes to be to live on paper. When I work on projects and, and, and you know my team and I tend to sort of look at at, at really sort of going at one concept at a time. So we tend to sort of go very, very deep into one area of interest. So the integration of idea and concept and story into a real experience, something that actually people can touch and feel um, and relate to. And I think the one idea behind the C collection is, is this notion that essentially our work has changed. The, the type of things people want to do are diverse um, and they're so configurable in so many different ways that the more you're going to find these magical moments where people are actually going to really adapt uh, their ways of doing things to, to your product. So the Curve Collection is about bringing, um, it's about two C's, it's about collaboration and it's about bringing uh, the complexities of the, of the work that we do. Um, and, and using computers and using technology and interfacing with people in different ways, formal and formal settings. And then it's also about the real sort of simplicity of a, of a singular curve which is applied to the entire line. In the work here with HBF, it translates to um, really innovative ways to sort of put the product together, uh, very innovative ways to uh, integrate uh, upholstery and uh, wood and metal and structure um, into something that hopefully looks uh, a fortress on this thing. I think what I try to do is to address all of the complexities, to not oversimplify in any way, but yet sort of reduce the first impression, reduce the, the, the final result to something very explicit, very simple, yet expressive.